Hello again, everyone. Welcome to part two of our three-part elective series, Singing for Musical Theater. Okay, by now, you should have picked the song that we want to experiment with. But if you have not done a vocal warm up, turn off this, go back and do at least an eight minute vocal warm up. I have already done my vocal warm up and I'm here and ready. Okay, when you pick a new song, the most important thing to do is look at the lyrics and figure out when am I gonna breathe? When am I gonna breathe? Because what you don't want to do is breathe in the middle of a sentence unless there's a comma or natural pause or God forbid, have to stop a note to breathe. You don't want to do that. Okay, so you picked your song. I am going to sing a song also with you guys that I do not have practice singing before. So this will also be the first time I'm trying to like learn it with you guys. I mean, I've sang along with it, but I've never performed the song before. I am picking Colors of the Wind from Pocahontas. So this is what you want to do. You pull your lyrics up on your computer, or if you have them written down, I have mine up on my computer. I'm looking through my song and I'm figuring out as I speak when I'm going to breathe, I'm marking it. So you think you own whatever land you land on, breathe. The earth is just a dead thing you can claim, breathe. But I know every rock and tree and creature, breathe. Has a life, breathe, has a spirit, has a name, breathe. You think the only people, breathe, who are people. So this is, what you wanna do is mark it. And then the first time you sing through it, you're gonna to wanna to see if that makes sense. Cause you're probably gonna to have to do some adjustments and say, ooh, I don't know. Oh, well that was too long. Well, I actually had more breath than I thought. Too quick on the music to make that, to take that breath. Um, that's, that's really like a very important part of this. It is also important to figure out where in your song you have notes that might scare you a little bit or that you might think you're going flat or sharp. So I always have notes that in my, I get them in my head. I start thinking, oh, here comes the big note. Oh God, here comes the big note. And I find that like three or four sentences before I'm even supposed to sing that note, I'm thinking, oh, here comes the big note, here comes the big note, which means I'm not even thinking about the current notes that I'm singing. So what I want you to do is look through your song and figure out where those trigger points are for you. Where are you nervous that you're either gonna go flat or sharp or you just can't hit the note at all? And you need to, ready for this? Practice them. You have to practice that part of the song. Muscle memory, what I spoke about in the first elective, is a very real thing. If you practice how your voice feels, how your body feels, when you hit that note the right way, your body will start naturally doing that. Because when you're nervous, your body's going to default to unhealthy mechanisms until you train it otherwise. So I will practice a note that makes me nervous like 30 times just until I feel like I am ready. I'm ready for that note. Another important thing that I do is I am not a naturally gifted singer in terms of like being on tune, being in tune all the time. I have a tendency to go flat and sharp. So what I do is I take my phone and I record myself singing and then I play it back because then you can hear the parts of the song where you may or may not be going flat or sharp and you just don't notice. Does that make sense? Okay. Just looking at my notes. Once again, we're gonna sing through our songs this time. You can watch me doing it and then do it yourself. And I want you to be thinking about the placement of your notes and the breathing. Not necessarily about what you're singing yet. We're gonna to get to the performance aspect in the next elective. Where am I breathing? Where are my notes? Okay? And I'm probably gonna mess up because I don't know this song very well. Then I'm going to get off this call or this Zoom meeting and I'm going to practice. Okay. Hmm. You think you own whatever land you land on. The earth is just a dead thing you can claim. But I know. Has a life, has a spirit, has a name. You think the only 
try it one more time because that is the note that makes me nervous. So I'm going to go back. There's definitely parts that are pretty rocky. Need a little work. So I'm going to put this down. I'm going to pick it back up. I'm going to sing it at least four or five times before I record my final performance. So before you access the third elective, I want you to have performed this enough that you feel confident enough to perform it and video it for me and then send it to me. I will then give you notes. If you would like to send me this version of you marking your breath and trying to figure it out, feel free and I will also send you back notes. Okay guys, I appreciate you. Talk soon. <laughs>